Alright hey guys, welcome to my mess. This is Eyebrows. Um, I come back from a recent trip uh, to the United States. First trip over there, loved it. It's a great country. Uh, many people would probably beg to differ, but uh, I don't care. It's a great place, I love it. Now, being an Aussie, and I love my tools, um, mate, a lot of the stuff over here in Australia is over overpriced. So when I went to America, I bought a DeWalt um, uh, drill driver. Um, stuff you can't get, well you can get DeWalt stuff here, but it's just overpriced. But I found some 20 volt lithium iron ones. So. And this this set costs about 200 bucks um, US. Um, if you go to my, I've got a receipt here from Sears that I've got over at um, New Jersey. New Jersey. Um, yeah, so $271 Australian, about 200 bucks um, US. So, anyway, cut the chase. This is the charger. Now, everybody in Australia knows that uh, you can't, with our 240 volt system, um, US is 110. So, I was in a bit of a pickle. Um, you'll see here on the back. So um, the input's 120 volts, AC at 60 hertz. Um, unfortunately for me, anyone else in this country, Australia, New Zealand, parts of Europe, whatnot, um, you can't use this charger without like a step step down arrangement. Now, I I bought it knowing that uh, I was taking a risk, and I bought it knowing that you know what I'm up for a challenge. I'm always up for a challenge. Now, oh, that's just like a little adapter. Anyway, it's a, it's a US plug underneath there with this little China thing I got on one of my other tools I bought on eBay. So anyway, stick that on there. Um, we'll open her up. Now, so you got your input in here. You got like a little variable type very resistor or something, not a pot, but I don't know. Anyway, it's rated 250, so I thought I'd leave that there. Um, this looks common between um, the two um, voltage sets uh, with other charges that I've opened up. So that looks very similar. Um, that's the same. Now, little MOSFET there. Now that um, I've googled the um, the specs on that. Um, yeah, not too sure about that one, but anyway, this is a bit I did change, it's a big capacitor, so the one that was in it is uh, 68 microfarads at 200 volts, so um, I took that out, I did a bit of googling and other people have converted Makitas and whatnot, so um, this one here is a um, I don't know if you can see that's a 450 at 10 microfarads. So anyway, I figure that uh, that should be able to handle the the um, voltage. Um, so anyway, here we go. So we've got a. We'll just without screwing it all together and whatnot. What we'll do, we'll just plug this in. Oop, there we go. Okay. Stick a got no smoke or anything coming out of it, so let's stick a um there we go. Beauty. So that's there's no step down charger. That's that's going straight in the wall. I'll switch it off there. No power, switch it back on. Power. So that's a win. So anyone there who's interested in buying stuff from overseas, especially the United States, with their 110 volt voltages, um, there you go. Happy days. Job done. Cheers.